Mike Rockenfeller was dominant at Brands Hatch as he comfortably took the race victory on Sunday. The German had qualified in second but was bumped up to pole because Martin Tomasic's car was found to be underweight. Rockenfeller finished 7.6 seconds ahead of reigning DTM champion Bruno Sprengler. The 29-year-old moved into the lead in the DTM driver's standings on 29 points, one ahead of Sprengler, with Augusto Farfas third on 25 points. Farfas failed to finish at Brands Hatch due to technical problems and ground to a halt on the 66th lap of the 98-lap race. Wickens was then awarded third after his fellow Mercedes-Benz driver Gary Paffitt, who'd crossed the line in third, was given a five-second time penalty for going too fast under the yellow flags after Eduardo Matara had crashed on the 89th lap. A mistake from the British driver saw him fall back to sixth place. But all eyes were on the triumphant Rockenfeller after his dominant performance. It's a dream race, of course, uh, you win the start and uh, at the end you're still first, so we did not so much wrong. So, uh, yeah, it was, was not easy, but uh, I would say uh, I had more difficult uh, races in the middle of the, of the field, so it was good to control the pace and it was just nice to drive the car. The next DTM race of the season takes place at Spielberg in Austria on June 2nd.